music turns very quickly and so does fashion. Fashion has a very short life. In the late 60s, Norma Kamali was an aspiring designer, hand-making samples influenced heavily by pop culture. Half a century later, she's known as the originator of the sleeping bag coat, high heel sneakers, the all-in-one wrap dress, and one very famous red bathing suit. Norma speaks at SCAD style on the evolving fashion industry and how health, fitness, wellness, and beauty are entwined. Thank you, Norma, for being here at SCAD Style. You give so much great advice about just looking great, feeling great, state of mind. Fitness, health, beauty, style, all really connect. So when you feel good about yourself, whatever you wear is just gonna look fantastic. Let's talk about your outfit. You look fabulous. I work out every day. So the outfit I'm wearing has my workout outfit underneath it. So I'm wearing so leggings mm -hmm. and I have a tank top on underneath. Mm -hmm. And right after a meeting, I can run to my class. It has to be convenient for you. But it also, I'm making a point about the modern aspect of having clothes that can function for workout, but also work in the workplace. You've been such a forerunner in so many different ways. I've owned my own business this entire time because I want to design whatever I want to design in whatever discipline. I don't want to be told I can't. But I also did not have an extraordinary budget to do whatever because some big corporation was willing to do that. So it's forced me sometimes with two cents to come up with a clever way to do something. You've seen so many fashion shows, you don't need to see another fashion no. show in your life. What's the alternative to fashion shows, do you think? I did these fashion films, fun storylines, but they're all wearing the clothes and it shows the outfit and you can see and then you can buy it with whatever device there is. I think we're so ready for technology now. Now, there is something to the in-person event and that I think could be done as theater or a dance thing where the clothes are a part of something whether it's VR where everybody can sit in a theater that moves much more exciting the, just a fashion show with girls walking with sad faces <laughs> looking stomping there's a population in our industry that love it but women who love clothes just like, that's not me. This, this is not my reality. There's endless possibilities for each brand to tell their story in their way in something that's modern and part of the future. Well, we're in SCAD style. What's your definition of style? Timeless style. So if you have a piece of clothing that can travel through life with you or a piece of jewelry and it persists and stays with you in a timeless way, it becomes a new kind of fashion that's much more valuable. And, and in the 70s, I thought about dresses. What will they be like 30 years from now, 40 years from now? So I have a dress called the All-in-One that you can wear a million ways. My swimsuit with all the shirring that I did in the 70s, the sleeping bag coat, and they're still selling in my collections today. Sometimes it's good not to change all the time. Sometimes it's good to have those go-tos that will always be good. To be able to be creative every morning, to have a creative thought and make it happen, that's joy. It that's totally joy. joy. I agree, I agree. Well, thank you so much oh, for being here at SCAD and for spending so much time with our students. My pleasure. And for talking to me, I've learned so much from you. Oh. Thank you. Well, thank you for all you're doing. I'm thank just you. so impressed. Thank you. Well, we thank you. women stick together. Together. Right. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you.